Welcome back to Character Select, Dave and Third, back for more. Life is Strange, True Colors. Chapter 3. Monster or mortal. Okay, that was a sound that you made with your mouth, alright. I'm eating a chalupa. That's a shirt. New outfit. Oh. I guess they told her. You have a superpower? <laughs> <laughs> You're both fucking with me, right? Ah, not fucking with you. Do Ryan and I look like the fucking with you type? It's all true. Fine. Then tell me what I'm feeling right now. You're feeling disbelief. <laughs> You're actually a little annoyed. You feel hurt that we didn't tell you until now. Whether it's true or not, you don't like being left out. Hmm. To be fair, though, we only just well, told Ryan. Okay. Yeah. She's been in Haven for like three or four days in the last episode. We gotta find oh, out what this shit. episode is. The foosball game. You knew exactly what to do. No. Eh. Oh, to cheer her up. Oh, yeah. Yeah, you needed it. You needed to focus on the positive memories, not get lost in the sadness. I thought it would help. It did. Just warn me next time, okay? Deal. Never thought I'd have a freaky empath friend. Pretty wild. So... Any sign of Diane today? No. But she was in yesterday working on her laptop. So it's been a day or two. You said she was afraid At of least. something around Gabe's death. Yeah. If she's covering up what Typhon did, I bet there's proof. I hope so. If she comes in today, let's be ready with a plan. In the meantime, I've got to finish my shift. And change my clothes, because this yellow shirt is not doing it for me today. Tell you what. No, I don't like that. Check. I should clean the dirty dishes around the bar. Can you? Ooh, a note. Jed, thank you so much for remembering my birthday last week and that Marco Esca Esquanda Tequila was excellent. You're welcome over at any time. Your best cook by a long shot, Francisco. Jed is just fucking 100% cool, dude. He's going to turn out to be the bad guy. I swear to God, he better not. Ah, Colorado tap water. AKA beer. <sighs> Peanuts. I'm not convinced this is totally sanitary, but what uh, not in COVID times. Not in COVID times. How do these bird washing contests even work? Oh, it's a bird washer lady. Yeah. In your face, Ryan Lucan. <laughs> I'm birder of the year, and your reign is finished. He uh -oh. was mourning. Better not tell Ryan I had a hand in that. There's an honor code among birders. Time for your bath. I've never seen it broken. Don't mind me. Oh, uh, hit tab. Oh, yeah. We got a bunch of stuff here. We got to find out what day it is. Um, go to, go to SMS. All right. Yeah. yeah. Uh, uh, cause there was a lot at the end of the last chapter that we didn't get to. It's true. There's Riley. Start at the bottom and work our way up. Hey, girl, thanks for the drink last night. Great to just unwind with you. Oh, it's May 20th. Holy crap. Oh, it's been a, like a couple weeks. Yeah. Uh, scroll up a bit. There was more to that. What's that? Yeah. Riley. Keep going. Because it was May 3rd. Okay. Let me know if there's anything I can do for you. Hi, how have you been holding up? Hey, Riley, I'm doing pretty okay, actually. Thanks. How are you? Good. Drowning in flowers. Please send help. Lol. Okay, random question. Random answer. Are you Princess Shushu 2539? Oh my god, how? Lol. No, really, how? <laughs> you showed me Shushu when I visited, remember? And 2539 is Alex on the phone keypad. I've been had. Ha 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 ha. Princess Shushu. So you played Dust in Daylight? Didn't take you for a JRPG girl. Yeah, me neither. I found it here and thought I'd give it a shot. Now I can't get enough. I thought it was 
I was playing I was playing single player only. You must have spirit guides turned on because I could see you wandering around the port of clouds. Ah, that's so cool. Can we play sometime? Let's check out the big scorpion boss. Love to. So, ah, that's yeah, it's like a uh, Dark, Dark Souls. Souls. Yeah, that's not really JRPG, but yeah. Dust and daylight. Dust and daylight might be Salt and Sanctuary or a reference to that, maybe. Yeah, something like that. I don't know if Square Enix doing a game like that, but not necessarily. Anyway, moving on. So it's after it's on or after five twenty. Steph. Yes. Uh, hey, Alex, it's Steph. So sorry. Hey, do you have a second swing by the store? That was the day that we did that. So we did with the LARP. So that was five one. So it's been nineteen days at least. <coughs> Hey, don't think you're done playing foosball with me. The rivalry continues. Go, go up. You're going too fast. Huh? Huh? I need a chance to redeem myself after that awful performance. I'm sorry. The championship was final. What? Just kidding. Oh, you bitch. Well, I was devastated. Love to keep playing. Come over tonight. Sick. Alex, I'm going to start running a tunnels and chambers game this week if you want to join. Hey, I have no idea what that involves. Sitting around with snacks, role playing a cool story, pretending to kill stuff. I'm summarizing. Is it okay if I'm terrible? One, you won't be terrible. Two, sit in on our first session. We can play it by ear. Rad. You free tonight? Ryan and I are meeting up and wanted to fill you in on some of the digging we're doing on Typhon. Hell yeah, I'd love to help. Yo, sup? What do you think about bringing that guitar over to the record store and jamming a bit? Like, in front of other living human beings? Just this living human being. I haven't played in front of other people in recent memory. I may be particular about a lot of things, but in this case, I'm a judgment-free zone. What the hell? Let's go for it. What time? Anytime tonight, I'm here. Think I need another jam session tonight. What say? I say yay. Yes, I have some ideas. Oh, dear. No, oh, dear. I promise. By the way, you're genuinely great. Genuinely great. You have a gorgeous voice. Thank you. That's way too yeah. kind. Maybe a downright lie. Nah. Let's get that, these two together. And that was five days ago. At least. At least. <sighs> okay. Uh... Oh. I should have saved him. I don't, oh, wait. Stop. Yeah. You should have had to see that. I know you're going through a lot, but can we talk? I know it's asking a lot, but I think I really need to talk to you. Thanks again for everything today. Glad I could help. Do you want to meet tonight and plan what's next for our super sleuthing? Absolutely. Just tell me where and when. Hey, you need a break from the all night research or late night research. Want to go mountain biking Saturday? Hurtling over dangerous terrain? So relaxing. Oops, Why? I, I hit How the right click. Dare. I right clicked. Uh. You'll have fun, I promise. Okay, I'll try. Don't worry, we can replace the front wheel. <laughs> my wow. ass still hurts, lol. You handled it like a champ. Short notice, but today's my uh, annual... Can we just can we just screenshot those two by themselves, <laughs> no context? Don't worry, we can replace the front wheel. My ass still hurts, lol. No, <laughs> oh. my ass still hurts, lol, and <laughs> you, you handle it like a champ. <laughs> uh, wait, scroll back up. A little bit more. Cool. <laughs> hey, Short yeah. notice, but tonight it, uh, but tonight oh. is my annual viewing of this amazing na nature documentary. If you want to join, amazingly, Steph is busy for the third year in a row. Row, I'm detecting a pattern here. Hmm. Is there a stuffy British dude narrating? The stuffiest. Right answer. I'm in. Mac. Huh. Thanks for the help, Chen. Just remember, I never told you anything. I risked more than just my job to talk to you. I hear you, Mac. Don't worry. Get some sleep. Easier said than done. Okay. 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 He doesn't have a picture. No. Uh, let's see. So. So sorry. Thank you so much. Can you buy the dispensary? Your speech. Okay, here we go. Yeah. Your speech on the bridge was beautiful. Thank you for being there for us. Of course. Diane stopped by with the affidavit again. I declined. I wish they would just drop it. I'm sorry, Char. Hang in there, okay? Hey, Alex, would you come over for dinner tonight? That sounds amazing. I'd love to. Can I bring anything? Just you. Maybe wine. Well, I'll see you tonight. Hey, again, I'm a little worn out. Any chance you could watch Ethan on Wednesday? Happy to. Can you pay me in more of those lemon bars you made from last week? For sure. Do you want the recipe? Nah, I'd much rather earn them by hanging out with Ethan than actually having to cook. Good deal. Hi, Alex. I'm so sorry, but I have to cancel our girls' night. I'm not feeling great. No prob. Do you need anything? I'm okay. Thanks, though. Char, how many of the gummies is too many gummies? Oh, <laughs> sweetie, try to relax. Can you tell me how many you've had? How worried would you be if I said five gummies? Did you have anything else with them? Alcohol? Other medication? Just snacks. Take a nice deep breath, take a drink of water, and lie down on your side. Don't drive or do anything serious, and it'll pass. 
You had a little more than the normal dose, but nothing dangerous. Okay, thank you. Did I ever tell you that I think you were so beautiful? Thank you. Just put your phone down and close your eyes. <laughs> hey, those texts last night were just totally just a test. Did I pass? With flying colors. Ironically, flying colors are also what I see when I close my eyes today. <laughs> <laughs> High as a kite. Uh, nice. That, that's a problem with... with uh, 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 Edibles? Candies that'll make you high. Mm. Is you instinctively want to eat lots of them. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's like the sugar-free gummy bears. It's like, hey, right. they're gummy you bears. You want to eat a whole bunch. And they taste great. <laughs> then, like, two hours later, you're like, I have no. made a huge mistake. <laughs> Nobody eats, like, two gummy bears. <laughs> oh, God. All right. Scroll up. All right. Nope, a little higher. Uh, oh, have, yeah. This isn't one we is... Okay, guys, I'm making this official. Welcome to the Takedown Typhon thre f ugh, Thread. Fuck yeah. It's an honor and a pleasure. Let's celebrate at Alex's place tonight. Shouldn't Alex make that proposal? Too late. Well, I guess I'm hosting then. You two free tonight for more scheming? Sounds good. I'm down. Crazy idea. Let's break into the Typhon office in Denver. I've got it all figured out. I bet they have server access there. We can find evidence. Steph, we're not driving to Denver and breaking into a highly secure corporate office. Boo! But if we did, could I be the getaway well, we, driver? We gotta save that for episode five. <laughs> yeah. Sure. But Steph, your license is expired. How do you even know that? Because he's a big loser. A loser with a valid license. You guys are killing me. Okay. So today is not 520. Today is at least, at best, 521. Because this Maybe. happened at 830 at night. Yeah. And it's clearly daylight outside. It's Colorado, though. Who knows what the timing is like? Not like that. For, for sunlight. Not like that. And then my block. Scroll down. Eh, 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 oh, there's so eh. much. Okay. Thank you all for your patience over the last few days. Still up in the air. Hope to return to regular business hours soon. Stay tuned. Either. Okay. Nothing big deal there. Glad I was able to help. I found I Chrissy. Pass on the kisses. She's been wreaking havoc on Miss Crawford's flower beds, but she's so safe now. I'm so glad I found her. Give her a big white kiss for me. First, yeah. doggy kisses. Go to the girl from the record store. Help me track her down. Alex? Damn. Legend grows. Thanks to everyone who showed up today. Sorry for how it shook out. What do you say to one last send off? Let's do it right this time. Sounds like a fine idea. Actually, I have an idea. Can we all meet on the bridge at 9 p.m.? I'm there. Me too. Bridge at 9 it is. So many memories of Gabe I didn't get to make. Thank you to everyone who attended the Gabe Chen Memorial Service and a special show of gratitude to those who spoke. I think we did Gabe proud. Do you remember that thing he used to do when he would get choked up but he was too embarrassed to admit it? I haven't cried since I was like 14. It's allergies. Don't look at me. Gonna miss him a lot. Same. <laughs> yeah. Well, I've decided to close my portrait commissions for the time being. I need to work through my backlog. Sorry to disappoint. That's the fucking story every time, isn't it? Oh, yeah. man, I should get some art commissioned. No, nope, closed commissions. God. Got to get through the <laughs> backlog. Last call for LARPers. For those who haven't heard, I'm planning a LARP for the afternoon of the Spring Festival, and I'm in dire need of NPCs. If you ever wanted to try LARPing, this is a fun, low-pressure way to get your feet wet. Come on by the record traders and let's talk details. To Stephanie. Did I ever tell you that I starred in a science fiction film? I was Remember, he talks, he talks all fancy. Oh, sorry. You're right. To Stephanie. Did I ever tell you that I starred in a science fiction film? I was fresh from Korea when the director, Mr. Julius Alvin Silver, spotted me in a hardware store. He said, Mr., have you considered being in pictures? Of course I had not. But in those days, I was eager to swallow every morsel on my plate, so to speak. So of course I agreed. The film was to be called Invaders from the Mechanical Planet. I believe I still have a reel around here somewhere. Should you wish to organize a screening ducky i have genuinely never wanted anything more in my life <laughs> i'm down i got plans for you kid uh-oh <laughs> i want I, I i would want to be the npc that just says uh you know Qu something like uh welcome to corneria yeah just one line over and over again <laughs> best Tension. job i've ever had 
not that the competition is super fierce. Blacklander is happy to announce that we have returned to our normal hours of operation. We want to thank you all for your patience and support doing, during what has been a difficult time for many in our community. Look forward to seeing you all soon. And on a happier note, we want to give a big Black Lantern welcome to Alex Chen, who has accepted a full-time waitstaff position with us. Be sure to show her some love when you see her. Nice. Go, Alex. Heart excellent news. Uh, Typhon yeah. Mining. Reminder to all Haven residents that Typhon Mining will be setting off charges tonight at 5 p.m. Please ensure designated drive danger zones are clear. Call our 24-hour safety line with any questions or concern. Please take note of our revised safety protocols publicly available on our website. Stay safe and have a wonderful Springs Festival. Call our 24-hour safety line with any questions or concerns so we can ignore them. My po- the poster has disabled replies. LARP volunteers, some of you still haven't synced up with me about your characters. Cutting a little closer, buds. Hit me up. To Stephanie, I've written an extensive backstory for my character, inspired in part by sections of Wu Cheng'en's Journey to the West. However, whenever I try to include it in this application, I receive an error message to the limit, the effect that I've exceeded the character limit. Thoughts? Well, I know what I'm doing with my afternoon. Can you drop off a copy at the shop? On my way! <laughs> God, I love Ducky. Ah, uh, fucking Ducky. Uh, we didn't look at the top one. I mean... Good morning, Haven Springs. The famous rose card has been polished up and stocked with our finest. You can find it in the park at sundown. Pick one up and present it to your Spring Festival sweetheart. Man, nobody's given me a rose at the Spring Festival. Don't worry, no one's ever given Ryan one either. Har har, we'll see who's laughing tonight. Me, at you. Yeah, probably. Dude, it's no fun picking on you if you're just gonna admit defeat. <laughs> Well, we gotta sadly, go get one for Steph. Yeah, he is gonna be defeated, unfortunately. Yeah. All right. Where do we even start? The gold glow, the way the pain and tension gradually fell away from Ryan's face, and then the laughter, the private joy of the moment when Ryan chose to turn a dumb mistake into a prank, the trust he had for Gabe. The certain knowledge that he could fuck with Gabe and get away with it, that Gabe would love him for it. I pieced it together, found it in the clouds, the goose, the car, the grave. And for just a moment, I got to have the sort of relationship with Gabe that Ryan had. I feel so fucking grateful for that. This morning, I thought I'd only ever know people through their pain. I thought I could live with that. But if it meant helping people, honoring Gabe. But then this. Joy, like a life raft, a pocket of air at the top of an underwater lake. Everything feels different now. The Royal Canadian Property Mounted Police can spot a grave's grave at a hundred paces. <laughs> Should have dug a deeper grave. It's the Night of the Living Geese. Now I'm wondering for goose aside by the Mounted Police. <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. I'm not going to read all of these because we've already spent no. like ten minutes doing this. Eleanor had fear. Wait, go back to Eleanor for a second. I didn't have the heart to tell her to see the pain again fresh in her face. Thinking about it now, I feel powerless all over again. Hmm. Surprised there wasn't uh, something yep. about the birding competition. Hmm? I said I'm surprised there wasn't something about the birding competition. Ah, uh, just a little side some, something. We already... Ooh, festival flyer. The spring festival is nigh. Nigh, I say. This evening, huh? All right. Ducky! It's the duck! Looks like Ducky's getting started earlier than usual today. He's got some cards. in the six figures, Ducky. Whoa. Chump change. Let's make it 12. <laughs> that That's a lot of money, Ducky. <laughs> it's a lot to of money. 12 figures is... That's a lot to spend on booze. Yeah. Jed hey, acts like he's in charge, but we all know who really calls the shots in here. I mean, it's true. It's the bear statue. Oh. oh. It's going to be a long night tonight. Always is. Same thing every year. Tonight's uh. the spring festival. I wonder what's wrong. Let's find out. Probably lost somebody. Hey, Ducky. Is everything okay? Of course. I've never felt better. Okay. Glad to hear it. I mean, she can read people's feelings, 
but if they don't want to talk about it, then she can't force them Duck to do Kate it. almost hustled me out of my yeah. first paycheck. Good thing Jed stepped in. More dirty dishes. Back from whence you came. This is a pretty cool bar. Like, I feel like this is a bar that I wouldn't mind hanging out in. Oh, it's her. Yeah. Yes, thanks, Steph. Thanks, Ryan. Hey, welcome. I'll be right with you. What's the plan? Do we have a plan? <laughs> First, we don't have a plan. We're, We're teenagers of attitude. Scooby gang. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Let's let's take a look around. We got some more time. Hey, jogger. Respect to anyone that chooses to locomote for sport. <laughs> Can't go on a run. Everyone will see how awkward and out of shape I am. Forget it. Been there before. Maybe I can encourage her. Yeah, let's fucking do it. Hey, can I ask you something? I've always felt too self-conscious to try running. You seem like a pro. Any tips? Oh. Well, definitely don't let that stop you. Just push through it, you know? I'll try that. Thanks. Hmm. Trust me. You're not alone. Alright. Now side the scanner. Uh, oh. Maybe. Got yeah, she she doesn't she's not anxious anymore. Cause we can't uh -huh. read it. So it worked. Black Lantern will be closed on the last Thursday of every month from eight AM to eleven thirty AM for town council business. Please direct questions and concerns to council chair Jed Lucan. Thank you for your understanding. Oh, that's cool. Hey, what up, my dude? Definitely the best boss I've ever had. Which, to be fair, isn't that high a bar. He's pretty chill. Did you trade out the quarters in the register yet? All you kid. So hmm. crown. What? What's the crown, buddy? Is it your birthday? Oh. You gotta sing happy birthday to you, bud? Maybe. A student. Where are you, girl from Rome? Gosh, I really miss that song. They used to play it. <laughs> Hit up the juke. Weird. I've never heard it. Oh, we gotta talk Maybe to Jed. Jed knows where it went. Hey, where do we keep unused jukebox CDs? We don't. Everything we have is in the jukebox. Cool. Just curious. Hmm. Let's go take a look at the jukebox. Oh, oh, God. Let's go take a look at the jukebox. Sorry, Steph, but there can only be one. Jukebox hero. Where are you, girl from Rome was the name of the song. Alabaster daydreams. Play the link. Raise. Man, the damn parge. I was saying boo urns. <laughs> <laughs> Shit gets real. Should have been me yesterday. Unfuck yourself. Words, hands. That's all I know. Rocky Mountain State of Mind. Open up a bottle, whatever. Whiskey 4. Bound to be a rebel. I think I know what song it is. Which? St. Joan. I think. Do you want me to look it up? I want to help this lady uh, out. I mean, what's the penalty for playing the wrong song? We just have to pick another song, right? We might only be able to pick one. Hold on. Oh. Okay. I bet we can play as many as we want. We aren't, like, on the spot here. Oh. Wait. Go back. Keep going. All the way back to the front. I have stopped looking up the answer. Uh-huh. That's not what this said at all. Uh, 
Go, go to the second song. Play it. Oh, it's his song missing. Jed's such a liar. I thought that was the fucking cover. All right, now we gotta find it. All right. He doesn't know. Okay. What's your jogger? Do you know? Cat actually helped. Hello, Eleanor. Oh, Eleanor. How are you? How you doing? I feel terrible for Eleanor, and I don't think it's getting any easier. Hey, Eleanor. How are you? I'm doing okay. Thank you, dear. I really appreciate your help from a couple weeks ago. It means a lot to me. Anytime. Of course. I'm glad I could help. Uh, Gabe's plaque is new, by the way. Steph and Ryan, the newest inductees. Gabe would be proud. <laughs> they passed out drunk. <laughs> Love you, Gabe. He came into this bar a stranger and left at his family. He was 26. Ooh. Rad jacket. I'm guessing boss man must be Jed. Hmm. That's a cool ass jacket. I love bomber jackets. They are stylish AF. I mean, we both played Final Fantasy VIII. That was not a bomber jacket. It's I close though. It was a leather jacket with a free oh, with a furry collar. I mean, that's very bomber jacket y. It's true. Oh, there's Charlotte. Charlotte must be getting ready for the LARP. Hey. Getting ready for the big LARP? Oh, hey. Yeah. Trying. I hope we can get Ethan into it. Let's read her. Is everything okay? Yeah. Yeah. Don't worry. I'm sure he'll like it. He's shutting down, probably. That's my guess. Arkanoid. We're not playing Arkanoid. It sucks. I hate Arkanoid. No, everything else is good here. Okay. I think we got to go up to our room, try and find that album. We're working. There was a mind flyer you missed too. Huh? What, not that flyer? one. Not that one. That one. We saw that one, didn't we? Not to be a single issue no. for or anything, but fuck Typhon. I agree. I mean, okay. single issue voting, boiling it all down to one thing is, is tough. It's not. So it's not back here. Okay. Let's go it's take upstairs. a look at Stefan Alex or Stefan Ryan. Jesus Christ. Uh huh. Oh, song. Hey, do you guys know a song that goes, Where are you, girl from Rome? Holy shit. Blast from the past. Alabaster Daydreams. My dad used to love that song. Gabe would put it on repeat just to mess with him. <laughs> Got to the point where he couldn't stand to even hear it anymore. So, what happened to it? Oh, eventually Jed pulled it out of the jukebox and stashed it somewhere. You could ask him. Sweet. Thanks. Hey, boss. Do the words alabaster daydreams mean anything to you? Oh, hell. <laughs> like brother, like sister, huh? Fine. Guess it's been long enough. It's back behind the bar someplace. Nice. Thanks. Oh, she's right there. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, Jed. The people have spoken. Yoink. Alabaster right. Daydreams. Let's hear this infamous song. Play song. Is that an achievement? Yeah, stop looking at my achievos. Jesus. <laughs> 
that shows up on the recording, so I have to so I have to have Jim blur it out. It's just I'm oh, sorry. It's fine. And you don't want them to show your achievements? I don't. Oh, they see the achievement pop ups. So I don't want them to see the friends list. Oh uh, well. Can I we didn't know your friends list was open. It's always open. I don't know why. Can we read her? One small victory that no one will ever know about. Hey. Alabaster daydreams. That's it. How the hell? Don't worry about it. <laughs> All right. Okay. She's here. What's the plan? Well, we have two plans, actually. But we're still workshopping them. <laughs> What does workshop mean, exactly? <laughs> it means Ryan won't admit that my plan is perfect. <laughs> okay, so here's what I'm thinking. I asked Diane out on a date. Wait, what? And she's <laughs> so into it. She doesn't know this one Ryan weekend, swiping her laptop. Ryan carries said laptop upstairs, acquiring damning evidence. Maybe Diane and I still hook up. Not important. <laughs> <laughs> That's your plan. Oh my god, please tell me you have something better. <laughs> <laughs> now to be clear, it's the same plan. Except I'm the distraction. Look, Steph, I don't even think she's gay, alright? She's probably into the rugged mountain man type. All the transplants are. What? <laughs> so I like that Alex was like, I'm not. <laughs> Even she uh, just looks down and shakes her head. Uh, Fucking love it. <laughs> I'm genuinely worried that these were the best ideas you had. What? It's a simple plan. Literally two steps. You just need to choose the hotter distraction. <laughs> okay, I'm not doing that. <laughs> Is the only tiebreaker we have. <laughs> this is a stupid plan. You guys are idiots. Okay, go Steph. She's the hottest. So am I picking who I think is more attractive then? That's basically what they're saying, yeah. <laughs> Let's go with Steph. Badass DJ? It's a no-brainer. Sorry, Ryan. <laughs> Fuck yes. In your face. Yeah, that's fair. <laughs> Look, I appreciate the... the effort. <laughs> so you don't even know if she has anything worth stealing. I at. fucking love the lines in this. I'm just oh my gonna God. try talking to her. Maybe I can get her worked up and read her emotions. I'll let you know if I need that distraction. Good luck. Booze. Thanks, Alex. Did that say beer fresh? What's the best? Probably. Way to rile her up. Uh. <laughs> what do you think? She was nervous, scared. I think pushing on that would be the best way to do it. Well, which way is pushing on that? I know you're responsible. That's my guess. All right, we're going for it. I know Typhon's responsible for my brother's death. I don't know how, and I don't know why yet, but I will find out. That got her attention. Mm-hmm. Alex, I can assure you that Typhon is committed to a full and open investigation. Thanks for the company line. We want to find those responsible and hold them accountable just as much as you do. That's the truth. That might be the truth that you see it. She's got a great poker face, unlike Mac. But let's <clears throat> see what she's really feeling. Let me try and read her first. She's like, could you, like, leave my booth, please? Whoa. 
I'm sick of the lies and I'm sick of taking the heat for this company. Interesting. If I can stoke her anger at Typhon, maybe I can find out more. What's the drawing? Look at it. Read. Nah. That's a good drawing, though. God damn, Ethan's talented. Yeah. Okay, what else have we got here? There's a nephew. I did not. I meant to look, but there's no look option. I suppose they do look up to me. I try to be the best role model I can. What? Cross, napkins, sticker, Typhon Flyer. What's the Typhon Flyer say? It's time to change your life. Join the ever-growing ranks of the world leader in excavation, mining, and distribution. Mining office is hiring. Mining companies hiring both field and office position, including team managers and directors. We're looking to build relationships with our communities, and that means giving you lifelong career opportunities you won't find anywhere else. Benefits, competitive pay, 401k packages, paid time off, medical, dental, vision. That's the basic bitch of benefits, guys. Try harder. Yeah. Competitive pay is not what you want to hear either. No. All right, what do we ask her about, you think? The uh, napkins? <laughs> Let's ask her about the Bloom sticker. I want to know what the deal is with that. William Bloom, huh? Yeah, he's the best. Singer, okay. Cross? Do you belong to a church around here? Hmm? Oh, no. Honestly, I'm sort of lapsed with all that. I do miss it, though. We're having a pretty civil conversation for walking in here and, uh, and fucking shouting and accusing at her. her. Yeah. I really want to know about the napkins. <laughs> yeah. Do you have um, <laughs> napkins for the table? Yeah. Um, yeah. I'm fine. Thanks. Yep. Integrity to our very core. What? Oh, yeah. That's our motto. It's a motto. What's a motto with you? Okay. Now I need to pick something that will push Diane's emotions over the edge. The drawing or Gabe's plaque? I mean, that one's the one that just showed up. So she's got nieces and nephews. She doesn't have a kid. I need to rile Diane up. Maybe asking about the right things could help. Uh, like drawing then? I mean, it could help. Let's try it. Ethan's a great artist, isn't he? He sure is. Okay. Nope. Oh. It's the plaque. Black. Look, I know you're not a bad person. But my brother is dead because of the choices you and Typhon made. How does that make you feel? I actually want to know. Hmm. Alex, I... We... She wants to say it. Typhon is doing everything we can to address the situation. That's the truth. Okay? But she's still so angry. I don't know if we messed this up or... All right. That's the emotion I was looking okay. for. No, Typhon makes her mad. About Okay, time to find out what Diane is really hiding. And we will do that because this has been like 40 minutes. Next time on Character Select. Oh no! Cliffhangers! So thank Drink you very much. Flint's for beer. Yeah, why not? So thank you very much for watching. Make sure to click that like button down below if you liked it. And third! Drink Flynn's beer. I, um, Kev, or Flynn lives. Flynn lives, that's the line. Yeah, hashtag Flynn lives.